Hey, May. You're calling late. What's up? I thought we were going to meet up for dinner tonight. Oh, right. I'm sorry. I forgot. It's been a hard day. We lost funding at the lab. Oh, Peter. I'm sorry. I also kind of got evicted from my apartment. What? Do you have a place to stay tonight? Actually, no. Not really. I hate to ask, but any chance you have room at the shelter? Well, of course. Feel free to use the couch in my office. Thanks, May. All units. Civilians are trapped inside their vehicles following a severe collision. Reports are coming from Stye Village. believe I haven't slept since the Fisk takedown. Gotta start taking better care of myself. Hope May's couch is comfortable. can't take this. You can, and you will. I'll pay you back. Soon. Just ask for help next time. Oh, you are so much like Ben. You have to learn to swallow that Parker pride and accept that you're human, like the rest of us. Martin. I'm sorry to interrupt. I just wanted to let you know I'm headed out of town. You're in charge while I'm gone. Well, you can count on me. How long will you be away? Uh, I really don't know. Is everything okay? It's some personal business I've been planning for a while. But please take care of this place. It represents the best part of me. Well, I guess I better get busy. Hope Mr. Lee's okay. Hello? Hey, did you see my story? I did. Robbie must be pretty happy right now. Yeah, it kind of went viral. And get this, Mayor Osborne just announced he's going to give Officer Davis an award this afternoon. Wow. Wait, isn't Osborne's campaign rally this afternoon? Oh, I see what he's doing. Yeah, we all do. But still, a pretty cool moment for Officer Davis and his family. I'll be there covering it. Wanna join me? Yeah, of course. See you then. Ugh, coffee's terrible. But it's for... Humiliating taking money from May. I should head out into the city and try to pay it forward. Cool win. 
Nintendo, but I always get the feeling something strange is going on in that place. Not getting much coverage. I should look for more towers to activate. Another message from Doc. Peter, I don't want to jinx us, but the lead I'm following might not only get the project back on its feet, but also expand it in ways we never could have imagined. Everything happens for a reason, even Norman pulling our plug. I really hope this works out. Doc's work is too important to go unfinished. water the job gets nope 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 she'd never admit it but the chief was warming up to spider cop his casual disregard for by the book thinking was a breath of fresh air she'd come around someday on the ceremony today. I'll be glad when it's over. A truck full of armed people scares me less than public speaking. But I'm calling about something else. What's up? Just got a tip of the demon the moon on a fifth construction site in Midtown. Incoming! Life with children might just as bad when he comes to cops Say good night. But I thought maybe my friendly neighborhood partner would want to know. Understood. I'll do a swing by let you know what I find. And hey, here's a tip on public speaking. Just picture everyone in their underwear. Wait, not Osborne. You know what? Uh, never mind. <laughs> Fisk brought all the small timers out of the woodwork. All units need immediate response to a 1030 on an armored car. Reported location is Kip Bay. Over. Demons robbing an armored car. Heart to heart time. Were you not loved enough as demon babies? Dad to withholding? Mom not around? Did you cry all night? A thing of beauty. Why do the demons need that much cash?
consolidated shipping. Jeff, I'm here. What do you see? Find the rest. The boss wants them dead. Looks like the demons are moving in on Fisk's territory. You got this? I got this. What you came for. You don't need to kill us, too. <clears throat> Fisk's territory is ours now. Not today. Kick it up and Like fish in a barrel. jumpsuit slimming stay out of my business wait the demons who's their leader keep my men alive and maybe I'll tell you saving bad guys from other bad guys not how I thought today would go around the outside to look for fixed mess. Sleep it off. I could have taken him. Sure, sure. We've gotta find the survivors fast. Hey, big guy.
You okay? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, thanks. Fist, your men are safe. Your turn. Who runs the demons? Maybe he's there. Maybe he isn't. Check the roof. I've missed these cryptic fist talks. That just happened? Yeah. I'm getting reports of a helicopter with a wrecking ball? Yeah, things with the demons got complicated. Sit tight, Yuri. I got this. I know. You need to bring it down. I know. Maybe you could superhero a little faster? Working on it, Yuri. Call you when it's done. to regret this. Hi, is this the flight to Newark?
Please don't screw this up. These masks are so awesome. Where do you get them? Oh, cool, thanks. Do they have a website? Yes. Whoops. Hey, Yuri. I caught the bad guys, but... But what? You might want to bring a ladder. Yo, Miles. Hey, fanboy. Oh, crap. I'm late. You coming? Uh, nah, I gotta get to City Hall for my dad's ceremony. All right. Tell your pops I said congrats. MJ, did they start the ceremony yet? They're still setting up. Where are you? We got hung up at work. Be there soon. the robbery at Roseman's auction house. What you probably didn't, but my sources confirm, is that the perpetrators were wearing... ...masks. Horrible, demonic faces. Yet another example of the explosion in mass criminals since Spider-Man came on the scene. Let's hear your thoughts. You're on with J. Jonah Jameson. Yeah, I see your point, but Spider-Man stopped those guys today. Saying he's like them because he wears a mask isn't fair. It's like prejudice. Wrong. Here's a little lesson in the English language, my friend. Prejudice means to prejudge someone before you know anything about them. I know all I need to about Spider-Man. He runs around causing chaos, wearing a mask so he doesn't have to answer for his shenanigans, and a flashy costume so he gets attention to feed his gigantic insatiable ego. Now, if I'm a mentally unstable person and I see him getting all this coverage, what am I going to do? It's called copycat behavior, people. There's the stage entrance. And we'll be right out front. Sounds like a lot of people out there. You'll be fine, honey. The last time I gave a speech, I was in high school. Miss Steinberg gave me a C minus. Well, if only Miss Steinberg could see you now. Hey, you got this, Dad. I mean, come on, you saved Spider Man. I'm pretty sure that makes you an official superhero. <laughs> a superhero? <laughs> or. Maybe I'm just a guy who doesn't give up. <laughs> Come on, honey. Welcome, everyone. And before I hand it off to Mayor Osborne, I'd just like to say a few words. Our city is so, so? Such exemplary citizens I think this gang war may finally be over. Like, like over, over? Um, I mean, there's some loose ends still to be tied up, but... Loose ends? Well, a truck pulled away from the scene from a company called Consolidated Shipping. Something's not right about it. I just don't know what. Hmm. Well, maybe after this we can grab some coffee. Figure it out together. Yeah. Um... Well, thanks, Jim. Couldn't have said it better myself, but I'll try. We all know that Officer Davis is a hero. 
But, uh, instead of coffee, maybe we could have dinner instead. I, I could come over, uh, I'll cook. Or we could, you know, meet at a totally neutral location for a completely normal meal cooked by professionals. <laughs> for acts of extraordinary bravery, above and beyond the call of duty, it is my privilege to present Officer Jefferson Davis with a Department Medal of Honor. Phone call, sir. Kind of in the middle of something here, Jim. Sounds urgent, sir. Fine. Congratulations, sir. Uh, thank you, Mr. Mayor. I share this honor with my family. My wife, Rio, and my son, Miles. Without their support, I... I couldn't do what I do. Yes, I've worked many years for this moment. Who is this? Over the coming days, your company, your city, and everything you care about will be destroyed. People will beg you for help, but you won't be able to save them. <laughs> Listen, jackass, I get threats like this twice a week. Why don't you grow a pair and tell me what you want? To watch you suffer. I need to get around somehow. Oh, <laughs> 
right there. I was right there. Gotta help him. to leave.
I'm sorry for your loss. Do I know you? I'm Peter Parker. I was at City Hall when... Look, I know you don't know me, but I just wanted to say... I know what you're going through. Uh, that's what you were gonna say, right? Or it all gets easier with time. Or don't worry. It's, it's a part of God's plan. I'm sorry. I was just try trying to help. I know. I'm sorry about that. I don't know what I'm going to do with him. Sorry, Jeff. I'm busy. What's up? Have you started looking for Martin Lee yet? No. I told you, I can't start a manhunt based on a hunch from Spider-Man. But I'm telling you, he's the guy. Get me some solid evidence and we'll talk. Solid evidence. Right. Hey, it's me. Hey, so what are you thinking? I'm thinking I screwed up. And that kid lost his father. I know you too well to say you should give yourself a break. What about the police? Do they have any leads on Lee? They're not even looking for him. Even Yuri doesn't believe me. Then it's up to us to find him. I've been doing some research. Go to this address. Martin Lee bought a controlling interest in this recycling center last year. You think he's hiding out there? Maybe. We know he's not at Feast. If he's not at the recycling... Center, maybe you'll find some evidence as to where he might be. Yeah, good work, MJ. I'll let you know what I find. Oh, one more thing. I talked to the detective about questioning the arrested demons. They're all claiming Martin Lee has the power to, quote, corrupt people. Corrupt? What does that mean? They say it's sort of like mind control. It brings out the negative part of you, it makes you do things you wouldn't normally do. Hmm, sounds a little far-fetched coming from a guy who can run up walls. Those guys didn't even have a license. MJ's hunch was right. The place is crawling with demons. Gotta take these guys out, then have a look around.
Okay, that's all of them. Oh, high security lock. They use these on banks, not recycling centers. Maybe if I can find where it gets its power from. Looks like I could override the circuit. I need my electric webs. Well, that did something. Looks like the circuits need a little more juice. There. Looks like the circuit's still stable. Maybe there's another junction box close by. Uh huh. Gotcha. Almost there. One more box should do it. That's it. from Fisk's construction site. Guns from Fisk's armory. These must be where they're planning to attack. Wait, these are Osborne campaign offices. All the paths originate from the same address. of high-tech equipment. Maybe later I can recycle this stuff into some weapons of my own. Truck bombs? This is crazy! This wasn't a gang war. The demons were stealing from Fisk to go after Mayor Osborne. Hey, did you find Lee? No, but you were right. Lee's using this place as a front for the demons. Bomb making, gun running. Oh my god. And it looks like they're planning another attack. This time on Norman Osborne's campaign offices. We must have some kind of beef with Norman Osborne. I found an address here. I think it's their staging area. If I hurry, I might be able to stop them. Be careful. 